More news now at 10 o'clock with local reaction to two years of free community college for qualifying students. The president announced his idea on Friday, and in it, the federal government would pay 75% of tuition costs, costs, but each state would pick up the rest. KETV News Watch 7's Chin Doan is getting reaction to this developing story. On a cold Saturday on this Metropolitan Community College campus, there's a hot topic up for discussion. Community colleges should be free for those willing to work for it. President Obama announced Friday he wants the government to pay for two years of community college education. Students like Israel Rodriguez say this would give many people a second chance. A few of my friends that have stopped going to college just because of that reason, they can't afford it, so this will be a good reason to come back. Many at Metro recognize the value of an education. Justin Miller is getting financial aid right now, but he's on the fence about the president's proposal. The government is fronting the money for me to go to school, but with this plan with Obama, it's more or less a different way of paying for stuff. Some say this program could create jobs on campuses across the country, but others worry about potential negative effects. Like if it's going to raise taxes or... Is there going to be stipulations so nobody really takes advantage of it? You know, because maybe a lot of people will start and then not finish. Eugene Bowles is still taking classes at 70 years old. He says whether college is free should be up to the state, not the feds. But it's another place where the government's getting their nose in, and they, they're not an expert. The people here are experts. The people running this school are the experts. No matter their opinion, these students say they'll continue learning as they wait to hear what's next. In Omaha, Shindone, KETV Newswatch 7. President Obama will discuss the proposal in two weeks during his State of the Union address.